Hey everyone, today we're doing some yummy oatmeal protein bars. Here are our ingredients and this is no bake. We're going to need a big pot for the stove and then a, like a pan to cool. I'm going to start with a few scoops of coconut oil. Coconut oil is really good for um, insulin resistance as well as lowering blood pressure and high cholesterol. Heat is still on about medium low. While my coconut oil is melting, I'm going to add the Himalayan salt. It's got a bunch of minerals and stuff that table salt does not have, even sea salt. Dry roasted peanuts. And that's it. I'm going to put the whole jar in here. You guys should check out those peanut butters in the commercial spreads. And oh my gosh, they have so much stuff in it that you don't want. So make sure when you get peanut butter, it says peanuts only. Peanut butter has things like potassium and magnesium in it, which is good for your heart. I got the big honey on accident, so I'm just going to use half of it. This is raw honey. It's really important to have raw honey. It has all these kind of vitamins and minerals that are taken out during the processing of honey. So you want to make sure and get the raw unfiltered. This is the 24 ounce. You want to get the local honey. It helps with your allergies. Benefits of raw honey. All our wet ingredients in here we're going to stir. About to add my hemp seeds. Guys, look at these things. What? Look at this. Protein, 10 grams. Oh my god. Look at these unsaturated fats. Oh my god. Look at these vitamins and minerals. 100% of manganese. 45% magnesium. All this and three tablespoons of this stuff. And that's about all we're going to use. Two and a half to three tablespoons. I'm just going to dump it in there. My goo is nice and warm. Oatmeal, a thing that I found out, it's really good for an anti-inflammatory anti diet. It's got this stuff called evanthromide. It inhibits inflammation. So now it's time to pour. Now we flatten. And I didn't oil this pan. This has lots of coconut oil in it, which will keep it non-stick. So pack it down good, and we're going to stick it in the fridge for... Like probably like an hour or two. It's been a couple hours and I think they're done. So I took it out of the fridge and now we're gonna cut it into squares. So I've cut them into squares. Delicious. Oatmeal squares. They're really filling, so you just need to grab one or two. 